मणि घोरा मणि जागे बाकतामूह लोयला थे देलानागर ब्राहजे बाकतामूह लोयला थे जेलनागर ब्राजे थकाए थकाए भजल को गाना गाना थे जान के रो ताए ताए बजल को गना गना थे जान घेर रो जल्ला सोनार अंग कारणी नो पूरा बाजे प्रेम जल्ला जल्ला सोनार अंग चारण नो पूरा मुकुंद माधव यधव हरि बोलिन बोल रे बंधन भरे जावस चल रे राखी शिव शरी रसाची जावस चल रे राखी विवास सारी रसाजे हेमान दुर्लभ मानव दे हो हया कि भावन के हो हे मान दुर्लभ मानव दे हो आया कि कर भावन के हो हे बे नाजी ले आशोरा सुता 
Sharane Pori Bilaje Ebena Baji Leya Shoda Shuta Sharane Pori Bilaje Odita tapana hoile asta, dina de la hoile hoi baby asta. Odita tapana hoile asta. Dina de lo boile hoi de biasta. Udita tapana hoi de asta. Dina de lo boile hoi de biasta. Tabe ke noe be alasa hoi. Na bajari dhaya raje. Tabe ke noe be alasa hoi, na bajari dhaya raje. Jivana Anitya Janahasa Tahina Navidha Vipadha Bhat Jivana Anitya Janahasa Jivana Anitya Janahasa Ahina Navida Vipadha Bhat Jivana Anitya Janahasa Nama Shraya Koriyatani to me Taka Panakaji Nama Shraya Namashraya Koriyatani to me Taka Panakaji Namashraya Koriyatani to me Taka Panakaji Jivera Kalyana Sadhana Kam Jagati Asi and Madhura Nam Jivara Kalyana Sadhana Kam Jagati Asi and Madhura Nam Jivara Kalyana Sadhana Kam Jagati Asi and Madhura Nam Avidyati Miratapana Rupe Rigogane Virajay Avidyati Miratapana Rupe Avidyati Miratapana Rupe Vigagane Virajay Avidyati Miratapana Rupe Vigagane Virajay 
Krishnanam Sudakore Apan Yodo Bhakati Vinoda Pran Krishna Nam Sudakori Apan Yodo Bhakati Vinoda Pran Namashraya Koriya Tani Tumi Taka Panaka Haji Nama Bina Kitu Nahi Koara Choda Boba Nama Haji Nama Bina Kitu Nahi Jago, Jago, Gora Chanda Bole. Jago, Jago, Gora Chanda Bole. Tota nidra chayo maya tisha tira kohole Tota nidra chayo maya tisha tira kohole Tota nidra chayo maya tisha tira kohole Bhaji Bhavaliya Ese Samsara Bhikare Bhaji Bhavaliya Ese Samsara Bhikare Bhaji Bhavaliya Ese Samsara Bhitare Bhaji Bhavaliya Ese Samsara Bhitare Bhavaliya Rohile Tumi Avijara Bhore Avidyara Bhore Kuriyaro Hele Tumi Avidyara Bhare Tomare Loe Te Ami Haino Avatara Tomare Loe Te Tomare loe te ami haino avatara Tomare loe te ami haino avatara Ami binna bandhu 
，但东方地平线上的地珠、红玉、风暴太阳、即将天主是再次演出，珍宝、珠、和伦巴、苏达尔。大声的念，大声，立刻醒来。他带着他的奉献者，行遍乡间，找访拉迪亚的城镇和村庄。穆瑞丹嘎古发出哈派，哈派的回声。罗伯有节奏的敲响着，就高人嘎金色的声息因沉浸在对神。心醉神迷的爱中而轻微颤抖，脚铃也随之叮当作响。主彩排练了。主彩排练了对居民们说：“话到，你们把你们夜晚的时间浪费在无用的睡眠上，用白天的时间专事你们的身体。现在应应用摩根大、马达瓦、亚达瓦。”哈尔滨这些圣灵的音正，田中牛的嘴，如冒犯的吟诵，吟唱吧。因为你们得到了稀有的人体，你们不在乎这礼物吗？如果你们现在不侍奉亚瑟大的宠儿，巨大的悲痛就会在死亡到来时等着你们。太阳的每一次升起和落下，就是一天过去了，损失了。你们为什么还保持着无所事事的状态，不愿侍奉、去尊主呢？人生苦短暂，了解这基本的事实吧。所以，把托付于圣灵，一直忙着为他服务，当做你唯一的职责。因为想要祝福所有的灵魂，为什么甜美的灵魂降临到孤独世界？此时正如太阳，把在内心的天空中闪耀，驱散愚昧的黑暗。可以，会使得生命的纯粹甘露，满足了巴克维努的塔库的灵魂。在全部十四个世界中，除了圣灵，别无其他。Hare Krishna, Shri Bhakti Vinod Thakur Ki. Okay. Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya. Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya. Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya. Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya. Om Namo. Bhagavate Vasudevaya. Om Namo Bhagavate Vasudevaya. Nara 
narayanam namaskrityam naram chaiva narottamam devim sarasatim vyasam devim sarasati vyasam tato jayamudhir hayat tato jayamudhir hayat nasta prayeshu vabhadreshu nasta prayeshu vabhadreshu nityam bhagavata sevaya nityam bhagavata sevaya bhagavati uttama shloke bhagavati nashtaki we're reading Srimad Bhagavatam canto 11 chapter number 26 text number 35. Kamala Murti, Nimeo Shoji, Nimeo Shoji, Meo, Meo Boga. Vaita Senas, Vaita Senas, Tato Pie, Tapo, Tap, Tapo Yevam, Tato Yevam, Tato Yevam, Tato Yevam, Urvashya, Urvashya, Loka, Loka, Nishpriha, Nishpriha, Mukta, Mukta, Sango, Sango, Mahim, Mahim, Etam, Etam, Atma Ramash, Atma Ramash, Chachara, Chachara, Ha, Vaita Senas Tatopievam, Vaita Senas Tatopievam, Vaita Senas Tatopievam, Vaita Senas Tatopievam, Urvashya Loka Nishpreha, Urvashya Loka Nishpreha, Urvashya Loka Nishpreha, Urvashya Loka Nishpreha, Mukta Sango Mahim Etam, Mukta Sango Mahim Etam, Mukta Sango Mahim Etam, Mukta Sango Mahim Etam. Atma Ramas Chacharaha Atma Ramas Chacharaha Atma Ramas Chacharaha Atma Ramas Chacharaha Vaitasenas Tatopievam Vaitasenas Tatopievam Urvashya Loka Nishpreha Urvashya Loka Nishpreha Mukta Sango Mahim Etam Mukta Sango Mahim Etam Atma Ramas Chacharaha Atma Ramas Chacharaha Vaita Senas Tatopievam Vaita Senas Tatopievam Urvashya Loka Nishpreha Urvashya Loka Nishpreha Mukta Sango Mahim Etam Mukta Sango Mahim Etam Atma Ramas Chacharaha Atma Ramas Chacharaha Vaita Sinas Tato Pye Evam Vaita Sinas Tato Pye Evam Vrvivasya Loka Nishpreha Vrvivasya Loka Nishpreha Bhukta 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 Sango Mahi Maitam Mukta Sanko Mahi Maitam Atma Ramas 
For that reason. For that reason. Evam. Thus. Thus. Urvasya. Urvasi. 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 Urvas
Loka. Loka. Of being on the same planet. Of being on the same planet. 在同一星球上。Nispriha, freed from the desire, mukta, liberated, sangha, from all material association, from all material association. Mahim, the earth, the earth, atom, this, this, atma ram, atma arama, atma arama, self satisfied, self satisfied, 自我满足的，自我满足的 ，chachara, he traveled, he traveled, 他云游。Ha. Ha. Indeed. Indeed. 的确。的确。Translation. Thus, losing his desire to be on the same planet as Urvasi, Maharaj Puru Rava began to wander the earth, free of all material association, and completely satisfied within the self. 译文就这样，在病除想到乌尔西所在的同一星球上的欲望之后，马哈拉吉普鲁拉瓦摆脱了一切物质联系，开始云游地球。他在自我中感到彻底的满足。Thus end the purports of the humble servants of His Divine Grace A. C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada to the eleventh canto, twenty-sixth chapter of the Srimad Bhagavatam. Entitled the Ila Gita. Shaman A. C. Bhakti Vedanta Swami Prabhupada 的卑微仆人，阐释《圣典波迦瓦谭》第十一篇第十二二十六章，标题为《Ila Gita》的要旨就此结束。So we Om Magyana Timarandasya Gyananjana Shalakaya Chakshur Militanina Tasmai Shri Gurave Namah Shri Chaitanya Manobishtam Stapitam Yena Bhutale Swayam Rupa Katamayam Dadati Swapadandikam Bandeham Shri Guru Shri Yata Padakamalam Shri Guru Vaishnavam Shya Shri Rupam Sakrajatam Sahagana Raghunathan Vitam Tam Sajivam Sadvaitam Savadutam Harijana Saitam Krishna Chaitanya Devam Shri Radha Krishna Padan Sahagana Lalita Shri Vishakamitam Shya He Krishna Karana Sindhu Dina Bandhu Jagatpate Gopesha Gopika Kanta Radha Kanta Namasute Tapta Kanchena Gorangye Rade Vrindavaneshwari Vrishapanu Sute Devi Pranamami Hari Priye Vancha Kalpa Tarubhyasya Kriva Sindhu Bhyare Vacha Patita Nam Pava Nebhyo Vaishnavibhyo Namo Namaha Jai Shri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu Nityananda Shri Adwaita Gadadara Shri Vasari Gaura Bhakta Vinda Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. So Lord Krishna had been describing the, about the experience of a great king who was one of the emperors of the world, named King Puru Rava. 就 Krishna 在描述一位了不起的国王
他一度是是地球的帝王，那普鲁拉瓦的经历。So p u r u r a v a he was a very powerful king, and he was possessed all opulences. p u r u r a v a 是强有强有力的帝王，拥有一切的财富。Like just as Krishna is Bhagavan, he possesses all opulences. This king p u r u r a v a had many opulences. 就像主 Krishna， 他是八个万，他拥有一切的富裕，所以这位帝王 Purava 拥有许多财富。Right? Who knows what are the opulences of Krishna? 呃，谁知道主 Krishna 拥有哪些富裕 ？Yes. How many opulences does he have? 一两，美丽。有，他有多少份？有几个？六种，有。Mainly, how you say? Wealth, 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 Right. Okay. So it has the six opulences. So this king Pururava had so much opulence that his glories were being described in the heavenly planets in the court of Indra. This Pururava, he had so much opulence that his glories were being described in the heavenly planets in the court of Indra. This Pururava, he had so much opulence that his glories were being described in the heavenly planets in the court of Indra. And one of the young ladies was called Urvasi. In Indra's court, there were many young women. Among them, one was called Urvasi. She was one of the favorite uh, ladies in the court of Indra. She gave a lot of pleasure to King Indra. She was one of the favorite ladies in the court of Indra. She gave a lot of pleasure to King Indra. She was one of the favorite ladies in the court of Indra. So when Urvasi heard about this man on Earth, she became attracted to him, and somehow she she came she came down to Earth, and she met with the king, and the king was immediately attracted to her because she was from the heavenly planets. She was very more beautiful than any of the women on this planet. Urvasi 就听说了国王的荣耀之后，就深深的受到吸引。然后他就来到地球上。当乌尔斯呃，嗯，来到普鲁这个国王面前呢，这国王立刻就被吸引了，因为他是呃远远超过地球上任何女子。Just like Draupadi, she was no ordinary woman, and many of the great kings who just saw Draupadi, they would also be attracted to her. 就像卓帕蒂，她。美若天仙，她美美貌绝伦，国王们纷纷被为她所倾倒。So this Urvasi was, uh, she she became involved with this King Pururava, but she told the king, she said, "I'm from heavenly planets. You're a man of this earth. If you want me to be with you, you have to feed me only food cooked in ghee." Urasi 呢，就对这国王讲了两个条件。他说你：“你你知道吗？因为你是地球上的国王，而我来自天堂，那你只能给我吃的食物是用酥油做的食物。” People in the heavenly planets they won't eat food cooked in oil. They only want ghee. 在天堂上的人们，他们的食物呢，不是用植物油做的，他们只用酥油做。And then she told. Another condition to the king, she told him that you should you should never be naked at any time before me, except at the time when we're engaging in sex. Urasi 提出另外第二个条件说，嗯，你永远不能在我面前赤身裸体的，除非就是在呃，在我们两个人在交合的时候。So in this way, Urasi was staying with the king, and he was enjoying a lot of sense gratification with her. 就这样，嗯，乌尔斯就和国王在一起，他两人享受很多的感官享乐。And this woman, Urvasi, she had with her some lambs. These lambs, the, they had come with her from the heavenly planets, and they were just like her children. 
，乌尔是从天堂呢，还带了几只绵羊。这些绵羊呢，嗯，就像他的孩子一样。And she kept the lambs with her wherever she went. 无论这乌尔是去哪里，都带着这些绵羊。Mm-hmm. 小羊羔，羊羔。So it happened after some time. King Indra said, "Where is Urvasi? I'm missing Urvasi. You should. Where did she go? Where is she?" 过一段时间，英卓尔就开始呃打听说，呃乌尔是去哪里了？我好长时间没有看见他了呀。So Indra sent the Gandharvas, some of the people from Gar Gandharva Loka. Indra sent the Gandharvas to go and find Urvasi, bring her back. Indra 就派了一些甘达尔瓦，哥仙就命令他们说：“你们去寻找乌尔斯，把他带回来。” So the Gandharvas heard how Urvasi had gone to Earth, and she got involved with the king on Earth there. 甘达尔瓦就听说呢，乌尔斯去了地球，和那里的帝王呢有了有染。So they made a plan how to get her back. They they came to Earth, and they took away the lambs of Urvasi. And when they were taking the lambs away, then the lambs were crying and making a noise, and Urvasi woke up in. She woke up from her sleep. These Gandharva 呢，就设设想了一个计划，他们就深更半夜的就来来到乌尔西他们的宫殿里，就把他的羊羔给带走了。嗯，当这羊羔被打劫走的时候，他们就开始叫起来，乌尔西就醒了。So when Urvasi saw her lambs were going away, she got she really got disturbed because they were like her own children, and she called out to her to the king that, "What are you doing? Save you should save my lambs. Where are my lambs? Go and you, you, what kind of hero are you? You should save my lambs." 乌尔西的看到了他的羊羔被劫走了之后呢，他就特别的受打扰，然后他就回头对他的丈夫就说：“你你算什么英雄啊？我的羊羔都被劫走了，你还在这里睡觉。” And the king had actually been engaging in some sense gratification together. The king was naked, and he 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 didn't realize that he was naked. He jumped up from bed and he grabbed his sword. And he went after to find out who'd taken the lambs. This king, the king, was having fun with Urvasi. So he was still naked. He heard about Urvasi. He jumped up and ran after him. 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 And she went back to the heavenly planets. She went back to the heavenly planets. So when Urvasi had left the king, he was feeling great separation from her. So when Urvasi left the king, he was feeling great separation from her. He was, he was madly in love with her, and he was thinking how he could get her back to end. To enjoy, to continue enjoy sense gratification with her. 国王呢，就是疯狂的迷恋着乌尔西，他就总是呃，恒常的想着怎么才能让他回到自己这里，和他继续感官享乐。And he even had the desire to go to heaven himself, just so he could be with her. 他甚至想要自己去天堂，只是和乌尔西在一起。But you. You can see this、uh, pastime of this king Pururava and Urvasi. It's told first of all in the ninth canto of the Bhagavatam, and then it comes again in the eleventh canto. Uh, Urvasi and this king's happy days are in the tenth canto of the Bhagavatam. Then in the tenth canto, it is repeated. So in the ninth canto, you hear about how the king is madly in love with Urvasi and how he wants to go there to be in heaven to find to be with her. That the ninth canto 就讲到了国王就是疯狂的迷恋着乌尔西，一心想上天堂和乌尔西在一起。But in the eleventh canto, we hear how the king has actually managed. He's come to the platform of knowledge, and he actually understood the situation. But 第七篇当中，嗯，这乌嗯国王呢，他实际上已经来到了知识的层面
and he say, he, the, the title of the chapter is called the Ayla Gita. Ayla is the name of another name for this king, Pururava. There are many Gitas in the Srimad Bhagavatam. There's, there's, there's the, the Gopi Gita, the song sung by the Gopis, and there's the Venu Gita, the song of the flute. So here you have the Ayla Gita, the song, this song sung by this king Pururava. So initially he was he was blaming he was cursing Urvasi for going away and leaving him. But later on, he understood it was his own ignorance that he was attached to the flesh of the woman. And he realized that, the, that what he was attached to was just a combination of the material elements. And he understood that the real platform, the platform of knowledge was to understand the person within the body, not just the, the dress of the body. From the Bhagavad Gita, Lord Krishna tells us this body is just like a dress. Just as we change the dress, we change also the body. 脱去旧袍，换上新衣。同样的，当灵魂离开衰老无用的躯体的时候，它会有一个新的躯体。When the cloth wears out, it becomes old. Then you get new cloth. In the same way, when the body becomes worn out and no longer of any use, we give it up. We take a new body. 就像当衣服已经破旧的时候，我们就扔掉。同样，当这个躯体已经 so what we call death is just simply the change of the body. So this king Pururava, he understood that what he was attached to was actually the body of the Urvasi. That he was in ignorance, that his, he thought the body of the woman was there for his sense gratification. But by, by the help of knowledge, he, he became detached from this situation. And he came, he became Atmarama. Atmarama, meaning one who takes pleasure in the self. Lord Krishna has been describing this, all of this, to his devotee Uddhava. Uddhava, you remember from the, the Krishna book how Uddhava was sent by Lord Krishna to go to Vrindavan to bring a letter to the gopis. The gopis were feeling separation from Lord Krishna. 
勾屁勾屁木牛姑娘们深深的思念 Krishna 与与他分离的情怀。And Lord Krishna wrote a letter for them and gave the letter to Uddhava to deliver to them. 就 Krishna 便给木牛姑娘写了一封信，派 Uddhava 捎信。So Lord Krishna wanted Uddhava to see the gopis and to see their great devotion, the devotion which they have for Lord Krishna. 主 Krishna 就希望乌达瓦能去见这些勾皮们，见证他们的巨大的奉爱之情。He wanted Udava to get the best association. 他希望乌达瓦得到最好的联谊。And here we see in this chapter in the Srimad Bhagavatam, Lord Krishna is again emphasizing the importance of good association. 在嗯，正念博加瓦他这一篇当中。So he told Lord Krishna to, in order to bring out the importance of association, 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 to bring out the And and how he overcame his ignorance with the help of transcendental knowledge. 国王如何是以超然知识克服了征服了愚昧 ？So coming to the platform of transcendental knowledge, he could take pleasure in the self. 当他上升到知识的层面，就便在自我当中寻求快乐。We were talking yesterday. In the class yesterday morning, we were talking about seeing the self, taking, turning within, not looking at everything around you, but looking within. 昨天我在早课当中，我们讲到，我们不要用一个物质的眼睛四四下里寻摸，四下张望，而应该内省，往内看。In the Bhagavad Gita, Lord Krishna describes how some look on the soul as amazing. Some describe him as amazing, and others cannot understand it at all. To Krishna, in Bhagavad Gita, he said that some people see the soul as amazing, and some people do not understand the soul at all. And some people hear the soul and are astonished by it, but others do not. There are a lot of materialistic people around. They have no understanding at all about the soul. Uh, in the uh, um, outside, there are so many materialists. They have no knowledge about the soul. Krishna says, "Out of thousands among men, only one is endeavoring for perfection. And of those who have achieved perfection, hardly one knows me in truth." Krishna says. 在千千万万的人当中，只有一个人追求完美。在那些追求完美的人当中，没有一个人真正的了解我。So Atmarama, King Pururava, became Atmarama. He, he took pleasure in the self. He is still not perfect in realization. 虽然 Pururava 王他已经是在自我当中寻求呃感到满足、寻求快乐人，但他的。He's detached from the material, but he's not fully understood the transcendental nature. He, 虽然不依附于物质，但他还没有完全的觉悟到超然的本性。He has to go on further. 他还得往继续。So in Srimad Bhagavatam, how many of you are reading Srimad Bhagavatam? 呃，你们有多少人现在在读《圣典摩迦尔谈》？举手。Yes, how far have you read? 读到第几篇？第三篇。第二章第三篇。嗯，对，第三篇。到第三篇。So in the first canto, the very first canto, there's a verse called the Atma Rama Sloka. 在呃瓦瓦塔的第一篇当中，有一部分叫有叫阿特玛拉玛的十六卡。Yeah, it's an important verse. Lord Chaitanya explained the verse to 
Sarva Bhoma Bhattacharya, and then he explained it again to Sanatana Goswami. Chu Chaitanya Sang Sarva Bhoma Bhattacharya, Jesula, Adma Rama Shiji, Chuho Yu Sang, Sanatana Goswami Jesula, Adma Rama Shiji. Because people read Srimad Bhagavatam, they cannot understand this Adma Rama Sloka. Atma Rama Sloka says that even those people who have achieved the platform of detachment from the material, who have liberated, who are liberated from material entanglement, they become attracted to hear about the pastimes of Krishna. Atma Rama Sloka 即便是那些已经弃绝了物质数的人，已经在自我当中寻求满足的、找到满足的人，这些人仍然对于聆听和唱诵，Krishna深深的受到聆听和唱诵的吸引。And the example of a person who became attracted to hear about Krishna was Sukadeva Goswami. 这被吸引到聆听唱诵 Krishna 的。人物当中的例子是Sukadeva Now Sukadeva Goswami had no attachment to the material world. Sukadeva Goswami已经对物质世界没有任何的依恋. He stayed in the womb of the mother for 16 years. 他在他母亲的子宫当中停留了16年. And then when he took birth, he immediately left home. 当他出生之后,他立刻就离家出走了. And his father was after chasing after him, come back, come back. His father was saying, wait, I want to initiate, I should give you the sacred thread first, I should make you a brahmana. Because Vyas is a brahmana, he wanted to put the sacred thread on his son. But Sukadeva Goswami was not interested in that. That's material. He was completely detached from the material. And then they were going past some place in the riverside the young ladies were there bathing. Young ladies were bathing, and the, the in those days the custom were these ladies they would bathe naked, and they were bathing in the river there. And Sukadeva Goswami came past. He was going away from home, and they saw him. The young lady they didn't even worry about him, because they saw he had no interest in them. 然后当他们就是路过了一条河流的时候呢，有些年轻的姑娘在河中赤身裸体的在沐浴，因为这是当时的风俗。就是当那个父父子俩看见这些年轻姑娘的时候，这个当那个舒克德夫·戈萨米看
。Sugar Dev Goswami 就是这样一位阿特玛 Rama， 他没有物质的依附。But when he heard the when he heard people reciting about the pastimes of Krishna, he became attracted. He thought, Oh, what is this? 但是当 Sugar Dev Goswami 听到有人在呃，在朗读有关 Krishna 的时消时光事迹的时候，他立刻就被迷住了。哎，这说的什么呀 ？Shri Vyasa Dev wanted to bring his son back home to educate him, so he would send his students. He would tell his students. He said, "When you go, wherever you go, chant these pastimes of Krishna. Chant these different slokas from the scriptures." 嗯，是因为是维亚萨队伍呢，希望把让自己的儿子把他再带回来，所以他就派了一些学生们，就嗯到各个地方告诉他们，叮嘱他们说，你们无论你去哪里，你们都去唱诵有关 Krishna 的事迹的诗节。And so they would go in the forest to go and collect the wood for the fire for the sacrificial fire, and when they were collecting the wood, they would be reciting verses they had learned from the scriptures. 当他的弟弟子、学生们、呃，门徒去、嗯、森林中采，呃，就捡柴火的时候呢，他们也背诵这个有关 Krishna 的，吟诵这个 Krishna 的消时光的诗节。Right? Do you know some verses? 呃，你你们嗯知道能回想起嗯一些诗节吗 ？Have you remembered some slokas? 你们有没有背诵一些呃诗节呢？ Not even one. 一个也想不起来吗？没有一没零一个没有。嗯、啊，我咋了？这三十一世纪人。啊？不叫黄色吗？不叫谈，不叫把谈。嗯，不叫放歌也可以。放歌可以，不叫放歌的时间也可以。把宋林顺会了吗？会啊。翻问。Govinda, 每天念线上的时候，你会念 Govinda 的祷文吗？你会唱？没有。啊？会唱前面，会唱前面，会唱前面。Yeah, this is how. The gopis, you know, the gopis every day when they're taking care of the cows and doing their work, they're always singing songs about Krishna. Gopi 母牛姑娘呢，每天在呃照料母牛、跟牛打交道，或者是做家务活的时候，都是总是在唱诵 Krishna 的诗。There's a nice one in prayers of Queen Kunti, a very simple verse. 昆蒂皇后的祈祷当中就有一个很简单的一首简单的祷文。Krishna ya Vasudeva ya, Krishna ya Vasudeva ya, Deva ki nanda na ya cha, Nanda Gopal Komaraya, Govinda ya namo namaha. It's very simple. This song is very simple. You can sing these songs all day. Sing songs about Krishna. Can sing all day. 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 Atmarama, he was detached from the material world, but when he heard about, when he heard the pastimes of Krishna, and when he heard the songs about Krishna, he became so. Oh, I want to know what is this. Shukla Dev Goswami, he is such a person who is detached from the material world, but he is now Atmarama. But when he heard about Krishna, the pastimes of Krishna, about Krishna's pastimes, he was. And he would ask the student, "Who, what, where is this? Where did you learn this?" They said, "Oh, our teacher taught us." And they would bring him back to see Vyasa Dev, who was his fa- actually the father of Sukadev. Sukadev Goswami, 就像这些吟诵
，这些导文的的学生们就打听，说你们是从哪里学到的呀？他们说是从我们老师那里。于是他们就这样把呃，舒克杜高高萨米带回了他的父亲那里。And so he stayed with his father. He learned all the pastimes of Krishna from the other day. 这样，呃，就和自己的父亲在一起学习了有关 Krishna 所有小时光。And later, then he Sukadeva Goswami could speak Srimad Bhagavatam. 后来，嗯，舒克德格萨米得以能够讲述圣典不教他。So this is devotee, the, the,、uh, this King Pururava, he became detached from the material, but. Still, he has to go on and become devotee. 因此，就这位普鲁扎瓦国王，他也虽然已经不依附于物质世界，但他还得继续灵修，成为奉献者。So even you may be at Marama, it's not enough. 即便一个人，你已经当已经是阿特玛拉玛了，但还不够。You have to become attached to Krishna. And so, for for devotees, devotees, it's natural to hear and chant about Krishna. 嗯，对奉献者而言，就聆听唱诵 Krishna 是再自然不过的事情。Our whole day is just chanting and hearing. We're spending all our time just trying to become Krishna conscious. 我们嗯，整天。我们那都把时间花在，只是为了让自己有 Krishna 知觉上。And this way we can protect ourselves from the material energy. 这样呢，我们就可以保护自己不受物质能量的掣肘。Just hold on to Krishna, and Maya will never touch you. 啊，只要紧紧的嗯抓住 Krishna， 玛雅就不会攻击你们。Okay, any questions? 好，那有没有问题？ Yes. 嗯，呃，两个问题啊，一个是就是，呃，那些那些女孩是通过什么方式，她们看出来舒卡戴巴是不是这个世界的人的？嗯，这第一个问题。啊、uh, okay. ，the the first question is， 嗯，什么 ？How did how did the king know that that woman is not of this world? How did the The girl, the young girls, knew、um, that Sukadev Goswami is not.、Uh, oh, how did the young girls know about Sukadev Goswami? Oh, yes, they could perceive it just from his external appearance, his external mood. You know, just like a woman, she knows if a man is attracted by her or not. 这年轻姑娘就从舒克德·古萨米的这个天真无邪的这个行为举止就能看出来，就像年轻姑娘知道自己就是别的异性，呃，是不是被他所吸引？嗯、hmm. ，So these women they could understand that this 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 young man is not at all concerned with us。所以这些姑娘们，她们就嗯就能意识到这个年轻的男子。他对这个，我们这些年轻的女子根本就不在乎。He didn't look twice at them. 哼，他根本就没有看他们第二眼。He didn't have any clothes. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Yes. 哦、oh, ，就是我们呃听到知识的时候，可是我们就是好像没有能够去呃深刻的理解，然后好像一要经历一些事情以后，然后我们才能哦了解这个事，就是好像真正的去体会到这个知识。那如果是就是说，那呃如果我们没有被玛雅攻击过，那我们是不是就是就是那我们能不能就是直接就是说？
好像不那能真正去领会那个知识的真正的内涵吗？嗯、my question is that although we have we know the knowledge in theory, but if we uh, haven't been attacked by Maya, uh, so can we um, realize the, the essence of the knowledge? If we don't have the experience of um, being attacked by Maya, because we only know in theory. Mm. Well, we have to appreciate, sometimes we don't know when we're being attacked by Maya. We may not appreciate that we're being attacked by Maya, we may think we're not being, but Maya is always there. Sometimes,当我们被Maya所攻击的时候,我们都没有认识到,没有意识到,其实Maya是无时不在的。there's it's either Krishna consciousness or Maya. 要不然我们是在Krishna之间当中,否则的话我们就是在Maya当中了。There's nothing in between. 没有就是介于二者之间的中间地带。Right? If we're not in Krishna consciousness, then we're in Maya. 倘若我们 没有亏心的直觉，那么我们自己就是已经是在玛雅当中。And that Maya can be in different degrees. Sometimes the Maya can be the mode of goodness. Sometimes it's the mode of passion. Sometimes it's the mode of ignorance. 那么在这个虚幻当中呢，玛雅当中它也有层呃程度不同，有时候在善良形态，在或者激情或者愚昧的层面。So when we in, in the course of our daily affairs, sometimes we, we, we don't always understand that we're at, this is Maya, that we're in Maya. It's not necessarily that you have to be in the great difficulty. It's not necessarily true that the Maya has to be a great threat or a great challenge to you and put you in a lot of trouble. 并不是说一定得达到那种严重的程度，就玛雅都给我们制造了巨大的问题，或者是我们已经面临巨大的麻烦的时候。But just simply the forgetfulness of Krishna, that is Maya. 仅仅是我们忘记 Krishna, 这就意味着我们已经在假象当中了。As soon as we forget Krishna, then we're into the the realm and the world of Maya. 一旦我们忘记Krishna,我们忘记Krishna那时刻起,我们就在假象的世界当中。So that, that Maya affects us in different ways. Sometimes, it's, it's bringing, sometimes it can be really bad, really serious, and sometimes it can be very mild. 假象Maya可以不同的方式影响我们。有的时候是程度是非常严重的程度,影响的程度,有的时候是温和的程度。Mm, different degrees of Maya. We, 所以, uh, Maya假象的程度是不同的。So we have to be appreciating the importance of trying to keep conscious, our consciousness away from Maya. 所以我们要 有意识的,就是刻意的要,我们应该把我们,让我们自己摆脱假象,远离玛雅,把它作为重中之重。You see in the Bhagavad Gita, Arjuna has to fight the battle. So, Krishna tells him, said, first of all, think of me, and then go and fight. 在不得放歌当中呢, Arjuna就要去作战了。Krishna告诉阿朱呢,你首先想着我,然后去作战。So first thing is Krishna, Krishna consciousness, and then we have to do the work, do our duties. 所以首先是去为Krishna之决,然后我们去旅行职责,去做干活。Do everything in consciousness of Krishna. 在Krishna之决,意识到Krishna,就在Krishna之决当中去做事,做一件事。just like young women, you know, they go to work, they're working, you have your job, 
But when you go to work, before you go to work, you know, you dress nicely, comb the hair, you know, paint the face a bit, you know, and you go to work. 就好像年年轻的女士去上班工作，她们就会首先在家里呢梳头，做一个发型，然后化化妆什么的。So you remember to take care. You make yourself look nice, to look presentable. At the same time, you work. 嗯，所以这个年轻的女士呢，就首先很意呃，只注意到自己的外在形象，然后才去上班。In similar manner, for a devotee, we first we make ourselves Krishna conscious, and then we have to go and do our duty, go and work. 同样的，对于奉献者来说呢，奉献者首先让自己呢，也拥有 Krishna 知觉。之后呢，他再去工作。So the, what we call sadhana, the spiritual practice, is where we get our Krishna consciousness from, so that we can go through the day. 嗯，我们就是通过 sadhana 规范修行，就让自己具备 Krishna 知觉，然后我们再开始我们这一整天的工作。We spend some time to chant, to worship Krishna, read the book about Krishna. It purifies the consciousness. We sing, we spend time singing, uh, to glorify Krishna, to purify ourselves. So you need to have that kind of program. You have to have a balance, a balanced program, balance the the spiritual with the material. So you need to have a balanced program, balance the spiritual. 灵性的程序是好和物质的这个活动呢，保持平衡。The train goes on two tracks. 火车是在双轨上运行。If the tracks are not level, the train will turn over. 哦，如果这两个轨道不在一个层面上，它就会翻车。So you've got to keep a balance with the material and the spiritual. 因此，你需要平衡物质生活和灵性生活。It's not just all work and no play. 不能说整天工作也没有娱乐。There has to be a balance between the two. 嗯，在这两者之间呢，需要有平衡。We have to spend some time to hear and chant. At the same time, we have to also work. 我们需要花时间聆听唱诵，然后同时呢，我们也要去上班工作。People don't just come and sit in the temple all day and do nothing. There's a lot of activities going on. 嗯，人们不会不会的，只是来到庙宇就在那儿呆呆坐坐一整天，因为这里有很多活动呢。嗯 ，Devotees are busy. They go out. They go out for different preaching work and propaganda activities, meeting people. 奉献者们非常忙碌。他们会外出去做宣传，做传道工作。So this way, we keep a balance, we, so that if we're always busy, that there's no time for Maya. 嗯，我们就这样保持平衡。如果我们特整天忙碌，就没有呃妈没有 Maya 的时间了。Because we're so many so busy to serve Krishna, have so many so many things to learn. 因为我们忙着在服务 Krishna， 有那么多要学习的内容。We have to learn to the slokas. We have to read the books. We have to understand these things. 我们要学习诗这些诗节，读书要，而且还要去理解。At the same time, have to also work. 与此同时呢，也要有工作。So there's no time for Maya. 所以，嗯，都没有时间给 Maya 假象。Hmm. Okay. Hare Krishna. Shri Prabhupada Ki Jai.